Alright, let's do a quick sound check. Make sure that I am audible. We want to make sure that everything can be heard. Talking at a standard normal voice. Hopefully not getting drowned out by any music or anything. Alright. So, it is now officially Christmas Day here. Um, it is 1.18am on Christmas Day. Now, I have just got back from destroying my neighbours um, in a game of Magic. A four-way free-for-all. I mean, that doesn't really change anything to do with what I'm playing here today. I just wanted to let you guys know so that you know how amazing I am. Um, but yeah, we're going to play some Superland. Now, Superland is... It's how I, you're looking at it. You're looking at it. It's, um... It's interesting. I guess. I think. I mean, I played a little bit of it. Played about 45 minutes of it and went, yeah, alright. Um... Oh, that was a while ago, though. Anyway, it's free on Game Pass. It is a free game, as if you have Game Pass, which most people that have Xbox have Game Pass now, I think, I believe. I could be wrong. Anyway, Game Pass is worth every penny, long and short of it. But we are waiting for 2077 to... to update. You heard me come back defeated. No, mate. No, mate. I destroyed everybody. I destroyed everybody. Well, the last game... I, uh, I didn't believe in the heart of the cards. So, you know, you know how it is. How unmighty. How's it going, Toyrin? This is Superland. This is... Well... You'll see. You'll see very shortly. But yeah, we had, um... We had two games of Magic with the neighbours. Four-man, or four-way free-for-all. And the first game, I just dominated because... I did. Because it's me. <laughs> of course I would. Uh, second game, uh, I got destroyed. Just thoroughly. Uh, and it's because I wanted to make everybody else feel good after destroying them in the first game. So, you know, you know how that goes. Deny, deny, deny. And if not celebrating Christmas, Mary Jack streaming. Well, yeah, that too. That too. But yeah, it's officially Christmas Day here. Um... But yeah, we may as well get into it, eh? I mean, I know everyone's here to listen to me yammer, but I may as well have something to look at as well. Thank you, Toyer. And what time is it over there? Must be pretty, uh, sort of, what, afternoon-ish? You're in the UK, aren't you? I'm guessing. Wildly guessing. Two twenty one PM. Awesome. So you have a whole afternoon to, to prep for whatever it comes tomorrow, I guess. Psychological warfare. You do need lessons in psychological warfare. Okay. So we are little red man. Sleeping on our uh a rubber bed or a razor bed if you prefer is our little home and this is our world everyone looks so sad and terrified why are we out of water I'm so thirsty oh shit we're out of water, please get down the pipe and find out what's wrong. Oh, this is my parents, so I'm, I'm apparently... I'm apparently royalty. Please help. Why are we out of water? We're just NPCs, you gotta do the work. Yeah, alright. I get it. Should we 
talk to... Listen to Daddy. Yeah, okay. Uh, is it a story-driven adventure? Uh, well, it's about to be. I don't know how much story there is. Hey, sword guy. It's not dangerous anymore if you have one of these. This is the well, so this should be full of water, I'm guessing. But there is no water. Ooh, money. Okay, so that's crouch. So do I have... I'll figure it out. I'm pretty sure this is only pretty short. But, uh... I'm sure we'll see. Oh no, big head skeletons. Be dead. Oh yeah. It's a, an adorable little... Uh, explorey type game. And you get abilities and you unlock stuff and you can explore around the place and do things and whatever else. What's this? And there's secrets and there's puzzles and there's, you know, all the best stuff that's in the best stuff. It's dangerous to go alone and take this. Exactly. That was a, that was definitely a play. That was what they were going for. Um, uh, it's very um, self-aware. The, the little bit that I played before. Oh no. Not the blues. Don't break our shit. Blues, yes. I guess I'm back up here now. Go to Blue Villain. Talk to their king. Mum? Mum? Ah. It's alright, Mum's onto it. I feel like... Where is it? This way? That way. Because there was like a little, uh... A little side bit. I think? Pretty sure. See, that's like shit that we can break by the looks of it. Okay, so that's all sealed up, but this isn't. But yeah, we're going to go on a little adventure today. Something pretty chill. We are waiting for 2077 to update. Which, uh, normally, normally everything automatically updates, but, um, it decided that it wasn't going to today. Secret area. So yeah, just to ruin the illusion, I did find this little secret area when I was in here. The other day. It took ages. Um, the update? So yesterday... Yeah. So ye yesterday I was sort of waiting for it, and then today I get home and it's a new update, and it's like a 16 gig update. It shouldn't be too long. But I figured we'd have a go at something pretty chill, because... My brain is uh, fried on... Um, playing Magic the Gathering for the past four and a half hours or whatever. It's not even a big one. Yeah, it shouldn't take too long. Hey, Paulie. How you doing, buddy? This, this is Superland. Uh, it's on Game Pass. Uh, and Cyberpunk has an update. Okay. Okay. We need to speed up because this walking thing isn't, it's just not doing it for me. You're bad at decisions, but so are our friends, and that equals a very long, drawn out game. Yeah. Yeah, it took, uh, took a lot longer than expected. But we're kind of teaching them how to play, so... They will learn, they'll figure it out. Hey! 
What's up? Do you want me to come talk to you? Giant red crystal. You should go there. Over there. Alright, buddy. More health, mix some green leaves and water in this juicer. Okay. Alright. Button. Did I have to go update Cyberpunk? Yeah. I mean, I don't know when the update came out. I opened it up and pressed go, and it's like, sorry, this needs an update, and I don't know why it didn't auto-update. So now we're playing this. An awesome event we have going. You've never knocked on your neighbor's door for salt? Different culture, I suppose. No, we don't generally interact with humans either. Um, yeah, our neighbours are, are pretty chill people. Um, and we have, we've sort of lived next to them for X amount of years in an apartment block, but I couldn't tell you any pretty much anybody else that lives here. When you run to the, into the neighbours in the hall, you yell, I don't live here, I'm just visiting. Forget I exist. Yeah, that's basically it, except they do it here without you having to tell them that. We knew they lived in the same building because we kept seeing them and waving, but somebody 3D printed some cute cats. And you were leaving notes trying to arrange for more. Turns out it was the husband. Sword range. Let's go ditch this at the shop. Go and make someone's day with a barrel of whatever the fuck. I love that the, the NPCs are so self-aware that they're like, we're just NPCs, you have to go on the adventure. Like, they just say it. I don't know what he's running around for. Excuse me, shop. Shop. Hello. Oh, health regen. That's probably handy. Max coins times two, hey? It's probably a good idea as well. Uh... We'll get speed for now. Oh wow, alright. This is way better. Glad we grabbed this first. What's this? Oh, this must be the semen pipe. I see. Men. Ha! Ah! Hilarious. Hello. Right, okay. What's this? Oh, okay. Why? You like the diversity in the NPC population? <laughs> yeah, they're all very different. This one's normal, and this one's normal, and this one's normal, but it has boobs. And this one, he has armor. He's cool. Look, he's got a face, scar, everything. That's how you know he's a different person. This one's Ryu from Street Fighter. The reason it's such a big patch on console? I don't know. It's 16 gig. But I'm also running on Australian internet, so we'll see We'll see what happens. It should be nearly finished by now, really. Do you have anything to say? Anything to contribute? No? Just walk back and forth and pretend we have a life in this town. Oh, well, at least you're aiming high. Amazing game. So much better than its predecessor. Perfect. Five out of seven. Nine. Ha! What? Nine. Uh, interesting. Because they tried to fix performance issues. Yeah, yeah, no, but they've had they've had a few of them. They've had a few pretty large patches, and I feel like one of them made things worse. Because I I haven't had too many issues playing myself. But um, oh Ben, but um. Oh, I bet I could get that if I just ran straight to it. Yeah.
Yes. Enemy health? See enemy health players and how much damage you do to them. Eh, fair enough. It was only 509 megabytes on PC. Lucky! You've had no issues besides Jackie not being at the chair after seeing his, the Ripper dog. And when Jackie was being a dick and trolling me at the door. Yeah, I had a problem. Like, four or five missions in, Jackie just stopped existing. I'm not too sure. Not too sure what happened there. This looks kind of cool. You just gotta hope you saved didn't corrupt. Yeah, I heard about that. I heard the PC's having issues. The uh, saves are disappearing or... Yeah, that's uh... That's pretty shit. Bring golden barrels to the shop for power-ups. Yeah, thank you. Thanks, Jesus. Hey, Mum, let's go. Hey, purple guy. Or red guy. When you have the force cube, come back and talk to me again. No, but I want those coins. I want them now. Come here for a moment. Sure. There is a barrel. Try to get it to the shopkeeper for new upgrades. Sure. For this. Okay. Eight megabyte save limit. If it corrupted, someone at CD Projekt Red is going out the window. Yeah. I mean, as heartbreaking as I know that would be, because it would really be shitty. Did you say you had finished it? So you were sort of done with it? Or were you still existing in the world, or...? Stay. Fire. Oh, okay. I should destroy these. Stay. Good. You finished it? Oh, okay. Uh, can you just come and kill me in a second? I'm just carrying a barrel right now, fellas. What this? Force cube, 20 coins. Alright. I can do that. Hey guys, here we go. Finished it so you'd be even more pissed, yeah. Losing out on so much. I mean, I, the only. Playing devil's advocate, I suppose, the only way that that could be worse is if you were nearly finished it. If you had, like, done all the side stuff and you're like, okay, well, now I'm gonna do, like, the ending. That'd suck. Wait, am I supposed to drop the barrel in there? Oh, because I can't get it out here. Yeah, right. I could do that. Go barrel, escapa! That definitely didn't do what I wanted it to do. Hey. Oh. With the force cube, I could get it out of there and bring it to the shop. Well, that's helpful. Jesse was saying he thinks he finished the game, but he isn't sure. That he did see the end credits, but he isn't sure if he finished the game. Yeah, he did, because he would have powered through the story and not done all the side stuff. I guarantee it. As much as I know that Jesse prefers to go through side stuff, and he does explore and do that sort of thing, if he wasn't paying full attention and was just enjoying the story, he would have smashed it out and then got to the end and been like, well, that's the end. Well, I don't feel like it was very big. Because that game is all about doing side stuff. You still need the other four or five endings? Yeah. Wait, this is where I just was. Uh, yeah, there's some coins. Here's some more coins. Be dead. Get out of here. So what's that force cube worth? 20. He was stoned and he was like, shit, I forgot to do a bunch of side missions. There's your fucking problem. That's it. Uh, I grab. It's mine. Hold to project, release to spawn a cube. Oh. Oh! 
Okay. Eh, eh, nope. Maybe. Can we not? Oh, look down and spawn the cube. Ah, I see. The side quest are fucking amazing. Yeah, I've heard. Just a couple of little things that I've actually done in the game. Hey, there's a barrel hidden up here. Oh, that's nice of you. Oh, can I not jump? I only just realised I can't jump. Can I drop... Can I drop this on you? Can I drop this on you? Eh. No? Oh, you can! Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, that's good. Oh yeah, I can do this thing now. So I can put the cube here-ish. Well, not on the floor. I don't roll. Stay. G'day, Dex. How you doing today? Welcome, welcome. Did it work? It did. Ha ha ha. More barrels for the shop. So my mum decided to wander off towards the blue capital to talk to their king. I probably should have followed her, but I'm all in like, collect all the things. What's this? Double jump. Oh, mate. Oh, but I've got to get that first. I've got to get the max coins. What's this? Extra sword damage, extra health. Let's go with extra sword damage for now. Upgrades, upgrades, upgrades. Yeah, I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing pretty good. It's uh, it's officially Christmas Day here, so I decided to jump on and wish everyone a, a Merry Santa Day. What was the weird, creepy head to big skeleton child? That's the enemies. That's that's these are the these are the bad guys. Killed them. We murdered them. Can I get on top of... Oh, I can't get up there. Yeah, thanks, mate. I know there's a barrel up there. So what's this? And... No. We go this way. One walked up the hill in the way for you. Yeah, so they're not, they're not real bright. They're not, uh, not the smartest enemies on the planet. What's this? Ah, I see, I see. I don't stand in the white ring. Oh. 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 Is it enough? Yeah, it is. Yes! Treasure! Health regen, nice. It's up this way. <gasps> Coins! Someone's gonna get sued over that coin pickup noise. Do you reckon Nintendo has a trademark on that? Like... I'm sure if anybody's played any of the Mario games, that's a recognisable sound. Or maybe it's just different enough. I can jump. Wait, what? Couldn't I not jump before? I'm so confused. Loot. Okay. Enemies now drop coins or health when killed. You get more coins if your health is full. Nice. What's this? This is one of those crystals. 
Uh, just gonna ditch that over there for a minute. Jump over there. No, you have the copyright and let him use it. Well, that's good to hear. You're a very kind person, Polly. You think it's just a bit higher frequency? Yeah. Oh, I can jump over here. Yeah, it is awesome. Now what? Nothing? Okay. You fucking blue cunt, come here. Here you go, Mum. Door's open. Oh, shit. Mum! Ow. Try to drop the cube on the monster's heads. Yeah, I'll, I've done that already. I'll do that. I'll do that again a bit later. We need to get as many coins as we can. Oh, well, we'll get one coin, I guess. And then we go back and we buy the coin pouch. Oh yeah, he's he's got he's got a lot of emotes. He's got a, an entire conversation. Probably, but... Oh give, uh, give as well, I guess. Now we can carry sixty coins. Jenny! Hey, welcome to the Adventurer's Guild. Thank you for the follow. Yeah. Can smash it. What's in here? Oh, hello. Hold down the force cube button to preview the spawn location and create a light. Ah! I see. Ah. Well, it's not really a secret area. He kind of told me to come down here, but... Alright. How you doing, Jenny? Oh, bye, wizard guy. Hmm. Hey, Wingers is back. Welcome back, Wingers. Just resubbed? Did you now? Well, thank you for the resub. You're a gentleman and a scholar. Uh. So I think I can. Well, that's health. I think I can, uh. Jump across some of this stuff now. Get out of here! Oh, that's why you wanted me to stream. I see, I see. I'm getting some delays on my um my phone and stuff, so I'm I'm only getting the uh the notifications that come up in the chat, unfortunately. But it is um. It is coming through slowly. How am I today? I am doing pretty awesome. Got back from uh, the neighbours. Played a little bit of cards with them earlier on. Can't afford the double jump to get over there. Awesome. And now here we are. You gotta go. Have a great scream. Just wanted to resub. Oh, well, it's always, always appreciated, wingers. You're a legend. Go and have an awesome time, and Merry Christmas to you, if we don't get to talk again. I hope, uh, I hope Santa brings you everything that you want. <laughs> Is the sub-notification bugged? Um, I don't know. I think it's just taken a bit of time. I've had some lag with my phone because I was sort of mucking around with it before and I may have fucked something up, but we'll, we'll figure it out later. Uh, I, 
suppose for now we should probably just move on to the next room because we need double jump anyway to get some of that other stuff. Yeah, I'm going to drop the cube on the monster's heads. Yeah, well, I can do that. This is where blue was. I see. Oh. Okay. Ooh. Tricky. So many secrets. It's over here. Nope. Uh, is this actually going to help me at all? I feel like it's not. Oh, maybe to double jump from? <sighs> Alright, Hashira. Lurks are appreciated. We are lurk friendly. Hmm. Well, we should probably go find our mum. She's around here somewhere. There we go. Hey, how you doing? Up there you can get to the giant crystal. It conceals a powerful MacGuffin. Oh, not a MacGuffin. That can save the land, or not. There we go. We can subscribe to tier one. Yeah, it's just delayed. It's just a little bit slow. <laughs> Enjoy the chores, yeah. If only it was that easy. Hello. If you balance over this wall and up the pipe, you'll get to the big tower. But you will need a triple jump. Oh, mate, I don't even have double jump yet. Don't glare at me like that. Thanks, wingers. Appreciate it, buddy. Yeah, I need to get around the corner, so I'll need double jump. For sure. But we should be able to afford that very soon with the amount of coins that are around here. Uh, yeah, here we go. <laughs> Fuck you, skeleton. Be dead. Ooh. More treasure. No. You're attached to a switch somewhere, I'm guessing. You felt tired and you were going to go to sleep, but now you're not tired at all. Mate, I have that effect on people. Just full of energy. Or something. Providing energy to all our buddies. Yeah, pretty much. Can we get on top? Can we get on can we go this way? Can we get on top of there? Do we know oh, we just need to go back and get double jump, don't we? Grab a handful of coins here. We'll go back and get it. Oh, there's a chest here too. Maybe that has more coins in it. Coins and coins and coins and coins. Treasure? Our health bar. Okay. Sure. The latest innovation in technology, giving you a visual representation of your health status. Bright parts of the bar indicate how far your health automatically regenerates. Fair enough. I'll take it. We'll power the planet on Jack's voice in gaming. Ah, oh, we'll see about that. We might go... We'll, we'll start with, like, just this house. If I can power this house with my voice, we'll work from there. Hey, Mum. How you doing? Get the MacGuffin from the Red Crystal Tower. Honey, do you have something to shoot that thing above me? No, Mum, I do not. Ooh. Oh, shit. I have no regrets. Okay, now we're good. Excuse me, Mr. Shopman. Uh, do you have jumps? Double jump. Yeah, there we go. Next one, 65. Bleh. Actually, wasn't there a... Oh, no, the crystal. I threw a crystal on the ground before. Where is the crystal? We must get the crystal. Hello? I threw it down here somewhere. Oh, yeah, here we go. 
Because that dude back at the start, Ryu, was like... Oh, yeah, that cool. Oh, wait, be dead. Oh, shit, he's got armor. Ha! <laughs> ah, that's good. Okay... There's a rainbow? Oh yeah, there is too. So we're in we're in a sand pit or something, because you can see like the house. Kind of reminds me, it gives me, uh, like the location kind of gives me like, um, Grounded vibes. If you haven't played Grounded, it's a very cool game with a lot of potential, but, um, color seems to be wrong. Ooh, can we use, can we use the semen outlet? Maybe. Stay. Hey! We can. Perfect. Did that work? Oh, it did. Excellent. Coins. Give all coins. More coins. Uh, oh, that's that's another one of those things. So we do have to get the MacGuffin. We can get on the roof there too. You don't know how you feel about this? That's okay. That's okay. I will take very good care of you. I will not lead you astray. It's probably what everybody that's ever led, led anybody astray has ever said. Just like, yeah, no, it's alright. It'll be fine. I don't think there was any other buildings that we could get into at the moment. So we got into those. We got into that. This one's sealed, but it's got one of those things at the top of it. Um... That one's my house, apparently. And that one we got into as well. So there's just a couple of them that we can't really deal with at the moment, but we will get there. Also, now that I have double jump, I can probably jump over to there and get all those coins too! Rickroll. Is he staying up? And he said that he needed to go to his sister's. Every time. Every time. <laughs> Ow. Oh, he's stuck. Ha! You're not going now because they're having a COVID party? What? A COVID party? What, as in a whole bunch of people are all going around together, or what? Never gonna give you up, never gonna let you down, never gonna turn around and lead you astray? Eh. Uh... You know the rules, and so do I. Do I need to put something on that? Yeah, I do. Okay. Fair enough. Well, I can drop the cube, can't I? I don't reckon I can make it over to that. Oh, I can. I can jump way further than I expect to. Go find the barrel. You go find the barrel. You've been up here. You know where it is. Or you wouldn't have been able to tell me, hey, go find the barrel. Ah, oh, it does so much more damage than my sword. Ah, uh, this way? Ooh, button. Oh, 
Oh shit. Um down? Oh yeah, there's a there's a bolt there's a spot for the block. Okay, let's respawn the barrel. There we go. Come here, barrel. Go, be free. I don't know if you should be able to roll like that, but I'm going to go with it. Yes. Freedom! Well, at least we know mum can't get through a door, so we don't have to go and rescue her. So what's everybody got planned for uh, for tomorrow or today, depending on where you are in the world? Triple jump. And I only need two more coins? That's a bargain. Can I go up this way? Double jump is definitely more for distance coverage than actually climbing. But I didn't get the thing. This one. Eh. Up on top of that. Hey everybody, how you doing? Are you dumb? Yep, okay. Uh, okay. Up and around, up and around. So, I'm guessing... Yeah, because there's treasure over there. So, I'll chuck this here. Here? Yeah, there we go. Beautiful. See that skill? Extra sword damage, always nice. Um, well, that's a shooty thing. This is a launchy, uppy thing. Oh, hey. Oh. This map is actually a lot bigger than I thought it was. I thought it was quite linear. <laughs> uh, this cube is, is far more valuable as an attack. It's just way harder to aim. Come here, you. Uh, oh. I just, I feel like that that's not gonna help me. Oh, what's this? Oh, I can raise it. Coins! More of them! I'll never go hungry again! Okay, cool. Ah, well, fuck you then. This way. We should be able to jump around that corner. You summon the cube of death. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Around the corner. Oh, it just turns that on like a shortcut. Oh, good. I'm glad that that had a shortcut that I could turn on because I just fell off. Shit, he actually really hurts. What else we got around here? Big old padlock. 
Oh, hey. I would prefer you did not do that. Actually, I, I love some of these little games that you find on Game Pass and stuff at times. Uh... Oh, don't know. Weird. That's a key. I'm guessing it's a key for that padlock. If I have to, you know, think about things myself for a little bit here, I can deduce that the key is for the keyhole. Genius deductive work there. Is this the triple jump bit? I think it is. Yeah, it is. Okay. I think that's... Oh! Ah! Key! Come back. Ooh. Oh, that's not good. Is that just a lava down there? Oh, I can land on my... You know what, I'm gonna get triple jump just so I have a little bit more room for error. And then I'm going to jump into the lava pit. What could possibly go wrong? This one. Okay. Hmm. You can't slow your jump when you're doing that either. Thought that might be a, a possibility. Hey! There's so many of you. Holy shit. Ah! Ah, fuck! Oh, they don't like walking into cacti either. Fuck. <laughs> ah, fuck. Stupid cactus. Secret coins. Out of here. I am all that is stick man. Okay, so let's drop this down there and hopefully land on it. Warm in here. Oh, it's spooky scary. Hello? Demons? Hello, demons? I feel like I'm doubling back. I am. I am definitely doubling back. Okay. Hmm. 
good. Oh, not good. On. No, on. No, on. Good. Oh no. Oh no. Poor Link. Okay. Poor adventure kid died while fighting it out with something that looks like a butterfly. Take your silly green hat. All fallen hero souvenirs are stored in your home. Hey, listen. Oh, really? Holy shit. Interesting. Okay. So I am back up in here. Can I climb up here now? Now that I've got the cube and triple jump and all that shit. I gotta be able to. What is the point of view? How strange. Okay. Um. Nope, that's nothing either. There's nothing up there. Can't go through this, whatever this is. Ah. That's at eight. We'll head back to the surface. Hey, why are you inside the village? Can't get that yet. Can I get it? That's okay. That's all right. See if we can get to that red crystal now. Oh, he got me. Uh, we had to climb up for it, didn't we? That was a triple. It was a triple. This side. Good job. Ooh, a little bit of max health. I'll take it. That's a pickaxe. I only just realized that's a pickaxe. Jumping and moving in this is actually really smooth for how, well, I thought the game looked kind of, um, tiny team made. I had to put it into words. I don't want to say shit. It definitely wasn't shit. It just, um, looked simple. Looked very, uh, yeah, we slapped that together, but place quite well. Oh, hello. Get to the MacGuffin. I'm going. I'm doing it. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. Hey. Oh, thanks. Okay. Follow the coins. Is 
здесь. А. Did that close? Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Oh, they're shooting now? You're dead. You look inside if you bring all the magic shells in the region to you. I don't even know what they look like. Low budget. Sure. That's a good way to put it. it looks a little low budget. At least on the cover art and stuff, but it plays quite well. Right, so they're coming out of the ground from the tombstones. Hey. Ha! Ah. That's great. Sure you're not. Can we get in through his roof? Is that what we need to do? Probably jump in through the roof. Yes. What's cooking? What's this? Oh, that's one of the shells. Okay, fair enough. Regen speed times two. There's a hammer here. And some crystal. Ow. What? That hurt me? That's unfortunate. Is that it? We ate all of his crystal? Righto, Heisenberg. Oh, you can continue not cooking anything in there. Is this treasure? Nope. Hey, you won. Excellent. Uh, I'm just gonna go over this one. Yeah, up, up, ow. Oh. Nope, okay. We will have to find a different path. Hydrate. Very good idea. Give me a second. That's the that's the red crystal we've gotta to get to anyway. And it looks like we can climb some of the way. I keep forgetting that we're in this, you know, fantastical sort of kind of ish world, but it's also just someone's backyard. Like we're just a toy in someone's backyard, and we're probably in the man in the imagination of some child. Either that, or we've become sentient and I'm now going to murder everybody. Oh, something's seen me. Back off. Don't you hate it when all your toys become sentient? <sighs> you had to walk around with a jet lighter and a hot glue gun and fix everything. Oh, okay. Those guys are going to shoot at me. What do you want? Under the crystal, there's a MacGuffin that is said to drive the plot forward. Oh, excellent. It's exactly what I needed. I was having trouble with my plot.
I've been muted. All the cameos in this are pretty cool. Yes. I hate it when that happens. You stop, you mute yourself, and then completely forget. And then everyone just hangs out and watches you play in silence. So this is just another way up. Yeah, it looks like it. <laughs> the hydrate took me off track and stole my voice. Probably. I keep forgetting that I can use that to climb. Ah! Ah! Get out of here! Hydrate and posture check. Oh! Give me a chance to oh, readjust my seat, actually. So I gotta go and start um, actually editing Legendary Kuru Adventures from Skyrim, which is my Skyrim playthrough. A lot of the episodes are actually up. We're into like the last 10, I believe, VODs or so. 10 or so. I don't know the exact number. But they, um, it was a heavily modded Xbox. I don't wanna use the word playthrough. Playthrough makes it sound like I actually had a goal <laughs> when it was more um, just playing Skyrim. Okay, spiky. What is over this way? Two coins. That can't be right. That can't be right. Come on. Two coins. Can I get on the roof? Mm. Oh, there's a switch for a shortcut. Ah, shit. Can I make that? It's not really heavily modded unless it's 200 mods. Well, it was 150, and because that's the max that you can do on Xbox. So it was heavily modded for Xbox. But I spent nearly a full month, because um, when we, we when we first went into lockdown in, here in uh, in Victoria, I spent nearly a full month of full-time hour days uh, testing mods and seeing what would work together and learning how to build a mod list manually and all that sort of drama. Which if anybody out there has mod or has modded a game um, similarly to Skyrim before, you'll know how painful it can be to make sure not only do the mods work together but that they actually cooperate with each other. So that was uh, fun and excruciatingly painful and one of the most satisfying things I've accomplished in recent years. All rolled into one. Hmm. Uh oh, duh. Put it on the switch first. 
There we go. Beautiful. Nowhere else, somewhere else. Here we go. Oh wait, no, of course. Put that there. There we go. Ooh, treasure. Uh... Oh, hey. How you doing, everybody? How you doing down there? Shoot fireballs or whatever the fuck at me. Ah, I don't have any jumps left. That cord goes over here. Oh. Ooh, coins. I'll take them. What is in here? Armor? Oh, mate. Only damage that is higher than three can damage you now. Cactuses can no longer hurt you. Sick. That's handy. Uh, no. Shortcut is... Oh, I'm lost. Shortcut is this. No, this way. The button opens the door at the very top of the tower. Do I understand this? Yeah. I get it. Oh, Okay. Sure. This mod shit and this one doesn't work, removes two mods. Ah, I've got the game working, perfect. Just gonna get two more mods to reach 150 even though it'll compromise gameplay. Finds two more mods that fuck up the order of everything else. Yep. Yeah, that's about right. Because you wanna, you wanna squeeze every little bit of uh, space or whatever out of it you can. Hey, fuck off, get out of here. Then you yell cunt? Yes. You certainly do. Loudly. Auto mod is a big fucking cunt. Yes, it is sometimes. Because I've tried to get it to allow certain words and it just changes its mind whenever the fuck it feels like it. Oh, we're not doing that now. Oh, okay, I see. Ow. I'm fucking... Oh, I can't even just randomly jump over there. I can't deal with them. I'm so over them. Guys. Oh, they just fell off. Ah! Well, then I jumped down and murdered them. dealt with back up to the roof oh oh okay right ah see so you stay right there you do this I stand here Drop it. Hey. I'm up very high. Oh yeah, that's the drop thing. That's the drop the box thing. And that's the door, I'm guessing. Dropping it. There we go. Stop adding mods, it's fine, you fix it. Adds mods anyway, it gets frustrated because it doesn't work. Hey, hey, I got it there in the end.
MacGuffin? Ooh. The mighty MacGuffin. Use it to kill enemies, to shoot buttons, and more. Hmm, I see. Oh, that's right, there's a switch in here, isn't there? Beep, 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 beep. Yeah, sure. Model is outdated, exactly. Exactly, but that's just the that's just the way of modding. Uh, where did we see one of these again? Who could have known that this is a MacGuffin? Exactly. Yeah, yeah, the, there was definitely one with like a zipline type thing, but there was... There was a spot in this little area, I'm pretty sure, that had one of those switches. Shit. 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 No, oh, I want to be on top of this. There we go. Secret roof zone. <gasps> Double coins. Again. I guess. Two seconds. I see. Huh. Uh. What? Yeah, so this is going to be a matter of just pressing it up against the door, I think. And then when the door opens, it'll just fall in. Right? Logically. Maybe? Maybe it'll work. Push button. Yes, perfect. More money! Holy sword. You can now destroy wooden graves and prevent enemies respawning from these. Oh, handy. Nope. Come on. Come on. No. I see you up there, money. You and I will be together soon. And up and up and up and up. Uh, 
Yeah, so it's still a spot in here somewhere. Oh, there's a spot. There's a switch. There's a brick next to said switch. Oh, hey. Oh, it gives you money. Nice. Oh, another one. Money, 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 money! Um... I am confusion. Is there a hole in the roof, maybe? Not really. It does, it, it does show a brick there. There's, there was a brick that was, like, glowing. I guess that back corner. This is the room. And it should be this one. No? Am I going to shoot it? Probably check on the roof of it. Hey, 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 cut that shit out. Don't need any sass from you jumping mechanics. Oh shit, kill those guys in two hits now. There, 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 there. Are you gonna close? No, okay, good. So where does this go? Sudden Jim Carrey, I've got the power, yeah. That is very much him. Come on. No. Nearly. Almost. There we go. Oh, this is back out here. Sandbox is built by him. He controls everything. Why are you doubting his existence? So you're saying the world is actually a giant sandbox? Yeah. Uh, okay. What the fuck was that? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit. What the fuck is that? for it, I guess. Come here, you. Oh, what the fuck? He's very fast. He also does lots and lots of damage. Holy shit. Does he get confused by the block? Kaboom! That'll do. Doesn't do anything either. We are back here. Which I suppose is kind of a good thing. <laughs> hey. 
Hey, fuck you. What's that do? Oh shit. Oh, they're ages away. Oh, they have just enough health to be destroyed by the gun. Coins go everywhere. There's something inside of you screaming, but Lego is an inside toy. <laughs> I, I, when I was, oh, I don't know. I was probably, probably 11 or 12. I'd saved up all my pocket money and I got myself uh, a Lego pirate ship. I spent forever building it. So much time, just like meticulously just building this fucking pirate ship. And when I finally got it, I immediately took it outside and went swimming in the pool with it. And it sank. And I was so disappointed that it didn't float. Uh, oh, okay. I guess that goes in the... this? In here? No? No? You don't want to go in there? See. Yeah, yeah. Such is life, eh? Hey. So it pushes the button, but it only does it for like a second. Didn't mean to do that. I think I need to destroy some more of these uh, wooden... Wooden doobly doos. Get him out of the way. Get him gone. Oh shit. That's lava. Lava hurts. So all I can guess is that the little wooden ones spawn the shitty skeletons. Enemy going around and destroying the shitty enemy spawners. All I'm going to get is the harder ones. And I don't know if that's a good idea. But I'm doing it anyway. So many of them. The price of your grave marker affects your afterlife. I think it affects your, your starting equipment. Or your ending equipment, I guess. So, you know, if you just have a wooden wooden crucifix, well, you're just going to be you. If you get yourself a stone one, ooh, that's fancy. Now, on the upside... Should be able to get back through here. Which is a nice little shortcut. Because I stand by the fact that there was another spot. Somewhere here? And then this purple cube fell from the sky and... Look at that poor guy. Aww. Aww. I killed Indy. Someone dropped a bunch of force cubes onto Adventure Guy's head. Well done. Now he's dead. You can take his worn out hat with you. <laughs> oh, fuck. 
It belongs in a museum. I think I've already been in this one. Yes, okay. But that's alright. I mean, I'm getting a decent amount of coins from a lot of these things, but I don't really have anything to spend it on anymore. Oh, that's right, there was the shell dude. Forgot about him. down through or anything. Okay. Our actions have consequences. Shocked Pikachu face. Actually, I, I got gifted a sub on some random channel and I can't remember which one it was. I think it was Fran Mirabella. And he's got that as one of his emotes, a shocked Pikachu face. And I thought it was one of the greatest things just to have as a set emote. something to do with that brick at the back. All the AITA posts, oh, am I the asshole posts, in which the person doesn't understand why something happened with the... happened wound up with actions have consequences. Yeah. I suppose we should go and help Mum get to the next place. We still need to talk to the King of Blueville. Was it in here? No. Ah, it must have been this way. There was an area that had some enemies and shit and I never looked. Just climbed over the roof and left. Oh, hey fellas. Compared to everything else so far, that looks distinctly like some sort of Minecraft type cube block. I don't know, I guess they were like, 
Oh well, just put a brick in there, I guess. Can I climb out up over this way? Oh, I'm so dumb. Why do I keep doing that? I can use this to climb up these things. I keep forgetting. Are we on top? Yeah, perfect. Excellent! I mean, it says blue, blue village is that way. I'm guessing it means through the little tunnel. But, uh, comes out the other end where, where Mother Dearest is. Good old Queen Mum. Hey, you alright? Yeah, okay, so it's down through the tunnel. Cool. Oh, you put a Santa hat on the emote. Nice. Okay. Perfect. Let's get to Blueville. Exactly. Okay, that's not a, a bridge up as much as it's just sticks. The biggest, most epic shootout with a shitty NPC. Push button on wall. Interesting. Oh no, He Man! Hair of Him Guy. You stole the hair of the legendary warrior Him Guy. By the neatly cut tips, you can tell he just got his hair done and must have stumbled on his way back home. Very sad. While turning away, you notice he looks silly without hair. Poor him guy. What is that? Is that like... Magma stuff or what? It's weird, whatever it is. Shiny though. I do like shiny. Oh, 
how long it's taking to build the sandbox. Six years. Crazy, isn't it? Fair enough. Hello, mother. Bunk it in. You need to get the two MacGuffins from the blue and purple crystal, then return to me. Oh, for fuck's sake. So what? This doesn't work? What does this do? What is that? I shoot it from here. Nothing. Okay. That's fine. Maybe I didn't want it to do anything anyway. Um. Interesting. Hello. You hope the gate is stable enough to keep the rattle hag contained. What? The rattle hag? I don't know what that is. But it sounds awesome. So that goes up to like a volcano. Power supply. So that goes up to there, and I have no idea how to actually power that. Oh, they're like hover platforms. Interesting. What are you? I'm missing something with those switches. Mm. Push button. Well, if that's the way of the purple crystal, how do we get in there? Maybe I'm missing an ability? <laughs> I 
I mean, I don't feel like I am. Because I really thought that I'd gotten everything. <laughs> you enjoy the emote, huh? Santa Bunny. Indeed, Albatross. Indeed. Oh fuck, I take damage when they do that. Well, that's shit. Right. I see. So I guess I should just smash the fuck out of him? Maybe? Oh yeah, quick tip. And that's something that... You should know about hand saws, just as a wave defense. No, wave defense. Um, yeah, hand saws. 
So you don't necessarily need a set square if you're cutting stuff with a handsaw. Because a handsaw, the handle itself, should actually, and this one may be stylized slightly because I can't quite get the right angle on it, but um, a handsaw usually across from the back of the blade, you'll have a 90 degree angle. And you'll also have a 45 degree angle. It's just the way that the handle is. It's the handle shape. So if you're looking to try and make a right angle, you don't need to go off and look for a set square or try and do anything crazy with rulers or bits of timber or anything else like that. If that's the way you want to do it, awesome. But you can just use a handsaw's handle to measure out 90 degrees and 45 degrees. Let's try that again and we'll see if we can just mow through people. Hello? Skelly fellas? Here you were on a different page, just listening, wondering why the fuck I needed a square edge. Yeah. Three shots. Get out of here. Oh. We're going to be doing this for a bit, aren't we? I don't believe that I'm ready for this. Ah, shit. I'm fucked. Ow. Ow. Well. Let's, uh, let's, let's, let's get a better sword, I guess. Or better weaponry, or more stuff. Like, shit, this game got technical fast, yeah. Oh, they've got to find a right angle blade for reasons and stuff. Ow! 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 What? Was it still going? Do you know the McMuffin Man? I do know the McGuffin Man. And we're running. I've still got old mate seashells too. <laughs> One more golden barrel around somewhere. If I... Hey. Be dead. You too. Be dead. If I get up on top of all this... You should make me say tongue twisters. I don't know if that's a good idea, especially with how tired I am. 
or is it a really good idea? Maybe another day. Maybe another day of dungeons is a good idea. Hey! You fuck right off. So what? I'm gonna get up on top of that. I'll get on top of that and then go this way. But how do I get up here quickly enough? Because we're going to be on this by the time the laser hits that, and it's not going to happen. Oh well. Also, there's a treasure chest up on there. Shitty life tips, but if I ask the laser to stop, I haven't actually. I have not asked the laser to stop at all. That's probably the problem. So I'm just letting it go about a bit. Get. Uh, I'm just letting it go about its business. I don't think I can get up there easily. I kind of like destroy shit. Well, let's dump our shells with shell, dude. Maybe he'll turn around and be like, Ah, you, person with the shells. You're my best friend. You want to see what's under the rainbow already? I don't even know if it's in the yard. through there. Hey, how you doing? There's two left. In that direction, there's another show. Really? Oh, I'll play shell hunting. Next. But in here... Okay, Ballista. Oh shit! Oh, fuck off! That kind of talk isn't appropriate for the stream. Well, Shell Game or Ballista? Oh, I know what I've got. 
gotta do. Chuck you right there. And then I have cover. What's under the rainbow? More of a what's behind the rainbow? Those mages just shoot way more than I thought they did. Ah, oh, he reflects it back at me and it can damage me. Ah. Uh, I'll, I'll try and remember that. This is the edge of the volcano area, I guess. Ooh, treasure. More max health. Where'd you say that other shot was, bud? Straight over this way, huh? Are we climbing? Get to the rainbow and siege starts. Yeah, it's actually uh, this is all uh, a really elaborate promotion for Rainbow Six Siege. Is it going to be their new hero? They wanted to go for something more realistic, so they picked a bread guy made out of clay that wields a wooden sword and has a laser weapon. Hey, where's the other one? That direction, huh? Alright. Yeah, it's not behind the signpost. Far this way, though. Oh, here we go. All right, buddy, I got your shells. What do you, what do you got for me? I have a feeling that getting to the blue village is the end of the game. Because I thought that it would be like, go see what's happening with the blues. And then there would be... Ooh, gun damage plus five. Nice. There would be the blues and then you'd be like, the blues would be like, oh no, there's something more evil. Something's going on. And then you'd be like helping out both sides. But it's a, for the amount of time that it's taken for us just to get to the blue village, I'm thinking it's going to be like, oh yeah. Oh, wait, whoa. That's awesome. Hey, I'm a fan of fast travel. Although that said, none of us did the thing for us. You still think this guy's sus might be the imposter? Hey. 
Has anybody played Among Us? I mean, I've heard it's pretty fun. And it looks fun. But most of the things that you see of people playing, they're playing with people they know. Although I have seen Call Me Kevin, the Irish YouTuber. I've seen him play a bit of uh, Among Us, just matchmaking. And, um... It looks, it looks quite fun. <laughs> From his... His side of things looks pretty funny. I don't think I understand what those mechanisms are or how to use them. You have, it sucks, it's not fun. Oh, that's a shame. Well, now, if you're a prince, clearly the blue village holds a princess that you need to marry. Yeah, I've got a feeling it's, it might be that kind of game, actually. Like, no joke, it's probably going to get there and be like, oh, you have to go and rescue the princess. It's poorly, he's the imposter. I don't know about that. Have flower. to get to either of those places. Have you been drinking, Albatross? So fucking tired. <laughs> I can tell. But you had caffeine, ah. Uh, so it's the whole, you're awake, but your body doesn't understand. <laughs> All of you are straight not to respond with a Yora. Yep. there. I'm not sure how to proceed. Oh, you can hold on to that. And I'm missing a barrel here too. you stop feeling the need to share with you what song is currently stuck in your head. Yeah, it's very much appreciated too. <laughs> 80 stars. I don't know what that means. Is that a sponge? I think it's a sponge. Okay, now this is full of water. And 
green leaves, eh? Can I use this? It's not green leaves, but... Something that's gonna be like making you strong. Gotta be. You totally deserve extra presents for all the restraint that you're showing. It takes a lot of effort to be awesome like you. I don't know about that. Please die. Oh, that's a pleasant thing to come in here and say as your first thing. I don't know. I don't know why that's... I'm guessing it's like a set of gloves or something. Oh, what's through there? Treasure! More coins. I'm full of coins. I've got nothing to spend any coins on. That's you, how I'm enjoying the game. Uh, it's pretty cool. I'm, I feel a little bit stuck at the moment. I'm not too sure how to get through the next door. I feel like I've missed an ability somewhere, but outside of that, it's pretty fun. I like it. I just got to figure out what to do next. Which is my biggest problem. Because there's this shit. So these platforms go up and down, and there's ones that are on the ground that shouldn't be. There's a switch on the wall, which I can't press. So I can't get through that door. This is the area you need to be in. Yes. Yes. But I don't... I don't have, um... The next sort of thing, I guess. I have what I need to solve the puzzle in this area? Right. Okay. <laughs> Gumption. Dedication. You're being cryptic to prevent spoilers or solutions. I appreciate it. I do appreciate it. I keep forgetting about the um the cube. Forgetting and not using the cube. Uh Let's get back up on top where we can actually see things. that does something. There's that, that is a shooty switch. I 
don't know if this has a range or if it just goes on forever. Battery must be on console for that kind of sensitivity. Yeah, yeah, I am. Yep, playing on Xbox. Come here, you. We are powered. Good. That's gonna lower it, but how am I gonna... Oh. I see. This will work. Yes. Get off that button. <gasps> Blue! I'll catch you one day, Blue. this on if you clear all the wooden graves in the area. Okay. Kind of plan on doing that anyway. Hmm. 23 stars. Oh, a new shop. Hey! Give money. Nice and simple, I guess. Awesome meter. Shows how awesome you are. Every open chest and board item makes you more awesome. Fair enough. Cool. You're empty, bud. Cleaned out. That means I should be able to open this door now. Another juicer. Okay. Treasure! deal with that yet. The metal. <laughs> I 
Secrets. The one back at camp was like 80. Or back at the, the home village. See. Get rid of all of these. Just while we're in the neighborhood. This <laughs> is <laughs> the kids' playground. It's just like, yeah, he's built it all. He's done it all himself. There's just cigarette butts. recipe. Water and one red seed. Put them into the machine in the cave. Seeds are behind the store. Okay. Fair enough. Sand pit. Cigarette butts and cat poop. Yeah, probably. Haven't found the cat shit yet, though. Yes, Ryu. Through this door, you should get you to the blue crystal. You should go there. Well, yeah, thanks for that, genius. Hey, 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 hey. Got that shit right out. Fucking serious. Ah! Water and a seed, and the seeds are behind the house, so we should probably suss that out in a sec, too. Unlock, please. Full of chicks promoting their Instagram. You gonna promote your Twitch on it? Do it. Be like, follow me on Twitch if you want to chat. I mean, chuck all the sponges down there. Seeds. We've got white seeds. Just 
take a red one. Take it down, chug it in the juicer. Hey, yeah, I see you through the wall. Sponges are all moist now. So if this is going to be a red seed in water and it's going to do something, does that mean that the other seeds are going to do shit too? That's kind of cool. If that's the case. They all have shit that says... I don't chat on Tinder, but follow me on Instagram. My DMs are always open. Well, this might sound like self-promotion, but Instagram is there where you can really get to know me. I have a feeling that they might not even be real people. But you never know. What did that do? Health fruits now give you 20 instead of 10 health. Handy. What happens if I make a yellow seed one or a white seed one? Instagrams lead to their other socials. Yeah, I've noticed the bots almost always say the same thing. I mean, whoever sets them all up, they put in a little bit of effort at least, but it doesn't really go far. Hey, how you doing? Force cube and a gun is all you need to solve it. Go for it. You don't need to touch any button yourself. Yeah, because I'll shoot it off the back. I'll push it down. I know. I just don't want to get trapped in there. <laughs> ah, there it is. I think there was one more around here somewhere. Or at least two more. Two more left to destroy. Huh. There's one. I mean, things aren't particularly well hidden in this game. Not that that's necessarily a bad thing. Sometimes it's nice to play something that you can just wander around and not have to worry too much about uh, hunting for things. Like a merry-go-round to fuck you and your effort. Yeah, TikTok is even worse for that. No bits, but social linking. Like every other TikTok has a link to cash apps. Yeah. But I mean, if it's making a money, then, you know. Not up there. Uh, Here, maybe. Maybe. Ooh. I 
Don't push me down. Oh, no bots. Okay. Ah, invisible wall. I see. You're not a fan of short form entertainment like that? You like hours of watching me run around and around in circles looking for the solution to a puzzle that I already have the solution for? I wonder if the other sponge is still spongy. Moist. Looks like it is. Yeah, it is. Oh well, let's put a second one in, just for good measure, hey? Why would you have other coloured seeds, right? Like, what would be the point if not to make something? Or maybe there's a different recipe, like mix one of each coloured seed, or whatever. You didn't bother with TikTok, but your ex-girlfriend kept sending you TikToks, and after like two days, you finally downloaded it. And he spent from like 11 p.m. to 2 a.m. just looking through it. Yeah, you did mention something about the. Uh, you put in like. your selection of things, and it came up as like. Um, a weightlifting. It's like a whole bunch of weightlifting stuff or something. I think that just gave me health. This is going to be the same, isn't it? Eh. Fine. get through there right now. Somehow make the lift stop in the middle. Hmm. The three interests you chose when you asked were beauty, makeup, love and relationships and drama and the first suggested TikTok was a Russian woman doing weighted one-handed push-ups and going, I don't want to be strong like a man. Not like pretty man. I want to be strong like a bitch who fight bear in wilderness. You chose those interests as a troll and TikTok trolled you back. Wow. That's, uh, that's fair then, I guess. <laughs> Ooh, 
push. Huh. Ah, ah, I getcha. I gotcha, I gotcha, I gotcha. Dunk. Yeah, thanks, genius. Hey, you blue fuck. Oh. Interesting. In Blueville, I think it was Mr. Miracle. That's, um, hilarious. Hey. I hope you get into the chapel and you'll open the big door for me. Okay. Oh, what? Oh. Right, so we're going to get him a halo, huh? Okay. Ah, it's one of these things again. Lovely. Fences sell so well since you color them white. Okay. Interesting. If you think a giant kid controls everything, why can't we see it? I know he exists, because if he didn't, we wouldn't be here either. Duh. This game makes some very interesting statements. It does. It definitely does. And their whole religion is based around the fact that they live in a sandbox and it's a... Uh, Till built by a child. Ooh, there's another shop just there. So in theory... Now it's red. Come here, shop. What you got? Not only useless, but also rusty. Okay. But is Heisenberg also God's will? Ah. Uh, uh, I don't know. Right, well that's pretty straightforward. So we need to make this yellow. And give it to old mate. Mm. Oh, so what else you got here? Gun critical chance, fair enough. Well. <laughs> Hope you have a very good reason for this. Uh... Yellow flower? Can I take yours? No, okay. Can I take this though? Yeah, there we go, that's yellow.
Oh. You and me, Angelic, might be fun. Okay, you ready? Let's do it. I'll hold it above you. I'll stand here. Look, you're an angel. A true Holy Spirit, come in. <laughs> Quick! <laughs> oh, that's great. Great Scott. You cannot shoot the bad guys unless you turn off the shield generators. Sorry. Okay. There's a bunch of key cards in this house. How can we get in there? With the shield on, shooting won't harm them. The sword can do a little damage. Thanks to you, I can open another branch. Bring me red barrels for cool stuff. Okay. I can carry even more money. Gun cooldown halved, yes please. Oh shit. See? What you got for me, buddy? What's in the barrel? All damage. That's fine. Is this his door? I gotta give it credit though, like this game sort of chugs along in a pretty decent little clip. What's in the barrel? In the barrel. What's in the barrel today? Follow me back, all right. Oh, for fuck, really? <laughs> There's always another one. How dare you follow me? Okay, so that's something else. Ooh. Free money.
blue. Back. Ay, fuck. <gasps> Not prawn. I remember that website. It was very puzzly. Otherwise, your hard drive says that you're not allowed in there. Computer says no. Right. Okay, so we gotta fry the hard drive. That's a different one, isn't it? Yep. That's at eight. Hey, Barrel, how you doing? There's a spot to like fall down in here or not? Nah, okay. Uh, barrel? What's over here? I went quite a way. What do you got for me now, bud? Can't cool down half again. Oh, wow. Yeah. Really shoot the fuck out of things. You keep sending your mother your Twitch clips, and she keeps going, I don't get it. Yeah, yeah, I feel your pain, bud. So, what have you been up to? Uh, doing a bit of broadcasting? You know, that sort of thing. It's been fun. What do you mean? Oh, here, I'll send you a video. Send a video. I don't know what that's supposed to tell me. Well? Key cards. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, we need key cards everywhere. Yeah, so I'm guessing this isn't going to work on the red key card stuff. Yeah. But I can probably go back to that last room and paint it, I guess. No red key cards. Oh, there will be. Oh, there will be. First thing, got to catch in this barrel, though. You especially like the are all the voices yours? Oh yeah, apparently I voice every character in Skyrim. Keeps being like, you don't drive very well. Your car is on the ro on a roof, but you drove into the water. I guess you need to be a gamer to get it. <laughs> Your car is on a roof. Ah, oh, the. Yep, I know what you're talking about. Gotta be red. 
if I run this back to the last area and paint it. Uh, here. I need to paint a green one too, but I don't know where I'm going to get a green one from. A green something. Should I paint a yellow one first? Am I going to need a yellow one? We may as well paint a yellow one when we've got a yellow one here. Were you able to get out of the car? Funnily enough, no, but she's asking the right questions by that point. Watch part two to find out. That's how electronics work, obviously. She's looking around the screen and not just at the videos because she goes, Is Cyberpunk you? <laughs> Is Cyberpunk you? Is it? Been holding out on us. Are you the Cyberpunk? sound like a username. Ah, yeah, I guess. Switch, I'm pretty sure it's going to move it up there. Aha, I see. Okay. Ooh, 
it's heist time. Cube catapult. Don't mind if I do. Well, there is like. More platforms up here, but I don't think I can get to them. Unlocked in here? It is. Up above. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, let me back out then, so I'm not too worried. Just waiting for that moment where I come out a door and I'm like way higher up than the normal area or whatever. I'll be here, there's gotta be a way around. There always is. But this is way bigger than I thought it would be, this game. Or it'd be just a. Uh, Crazy little jaunt. Hey Ryu. There is a powerful tool in this room up there, I was told. Hmm. Oh, we're just gonna get in there from the top. Okay. That's doable. Ah. I see. Like fall flat where it's just sky and you fall onto a new <laughs> island. Not necessarily. More like just things sort of looping back on themselves and being shortcuts to other places and that sort of shit. Stomp shoes. Yes. Go away. Ah, that room. Okay, cool. Are you red again?
Maybe? Holy fuck. How long does this cord want to be? Did that just turn it off? I guess. It's not that easy really, is it? Sudden unplanned skydiving. No, no, no. No, adventuring. Having fun. And then falling. Okay. Fair enough. <laughs> what is in here? Yeah. Hey Heisenberg, how you doing? I broke your roof, huh? Sorry, buddy. Orange jump pads take mid-air control away from you, but blue ones let you steer, jump, or stomp. Interesting. Uh, okay. Maybe you want to do a double jump. And up. Ooh. Treasure! Bouncy thing, etc. 
You can't wait for Christmas and your niece opens her Oculus so that you can play it? <laughs> is she getting an Oculus, is she? Lucky girl. I reckon the Oculus Quest looks kind of cool, just because it's standalone. But, um... Here, it costs pretty much the same as a brand new console anyway, so it's sort of like... Is it worth getting an Oculus? Just for the handful of games that it can play. It'll probably be cute to watch her too. You're pretty sure it's the Quest. Yeah, the Quest, the quest is the standalone one. To, as far as my knowledge goes at least. Uh. Okay. We're electrifying something. Watch out so she goes with anything fast or anything. Okay. Any stompy buttons? Any buttons that want to get turned into a fine paste? Is there anything green I can pick up? I don't think so. Yeah, with with uh with VR, sometimes it can be you know, you can give you motion sickness, upset stomach, whatever else. It depends on the game that you're playing too. What about something like yellow and blue? But I don't have blue. And so far all the colours that have been dropping in here have been turning it that colour, not a mixture of them. Hmm. 
rude. Ooh, well, I think that might be it for this evening. I'll come back with a fresh set of eyes tomorrow. So much for a game that we just play while we wait for it to, um... While we wait for Cyberpunk to update. No, you can't use Cacti, unfortunately. Yeah, there's a shooty thing. That's glass, I'm pretty sure. What's the random green pipe from the rock wall? I'm not too sure. Yeah, Jack's still here. It's funny that you come back when I say that, though. Because <laughs> you, you, it's like you were summoned from me saying, eh, I might call it there. You outskilled someone. Who'd you outskill? What happened? Tell me. Tell me the story. Let me live vicariously through you, Tyrant. Oh, some cunt building in Fortnite. Right. What, you want to smash the other boards before you move on with your life? very valuable can be used for something handy I guess we uh That might work. I mean, it's never been something they've alluded to before, but... Might work. Who's that? It looks like it's something as well. Let's see if we can make the jump. 
very much not. Like, not even a little bit. It does. It fires him out. That's... A little bit dumb. Okay, so if we get up here, is there a way to move? Oh, is it this? does it do? Hmm. Electrifies that, but I don't know what else it does. I'm not too sure. I'm very tired. So, I need to come back to this with a set of awake eyes. But it's actually been way more interesting and way more engaging for me than I really thought it would be. Um, I've had a lot of fun doing this. Just mucking around. Might, uh, might be a good game to sort of keep in the back pocket. For a rainy day, so to speak. It's been quite pleasant. And the puzzles are good too. They're a bit of fun. Ooh, red card, okay. Alright, well. That brings us back once again. I hope that everybody that... Uh, well, first off, thank you everybody that did come by today to spend a very, very early Christmas morning hanging out. Uh, thank you to Jenny Sweets for the follow. Special thanks to Wingers for the resub. It's two months there. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, thank you to Hashira. Thanks, Toyrin. You guys have been hanging out. Thanks to Paulie. Did have another couple of people drop by here and there. Thanks, Dex. Trying to make sure that I haven't forgotten anybody. Wouldn't want to. But yeah, it has been an awesome early morning, late night, whatever it may be. Paulie's still around, he thought he was tired ages ago. He was, he was. He was here not long ago though. He was talking about uh, the Oculus Quest and his niece and motion sickness and stuff, like probably 10 minutes ago. Oh, you're more than welcome. Um, but I hope that everybody, uh, I hope that everybody has had an awesome day. And I hope you have a better tomorrow, especially considering that it is Christmas day for a lot of people. So whatever you end up doing, I hope your day is awesome, whether that is catching up with family or doing the whole Christmas thing or um, 
just hanging out at home with a couple of uh, close ones or by yourself, depending on how you want to do things. Just relaxing. Just have a good day. But yeah, stay awesome. I will talk to you all next time. See ya.